Well, hey folks, welcome all back, and oh man, what are you doing today, Tom? Folks, there's the Blackstone Pizza Oven, and uh, you're wondering, why is there a pizza stone on the Blackstone Griddle? Well, one of my last videos, uh, I tried making Papa Murphy's uh, Take and Bake Pizza on here, and I think I had things too hot, and it was a fail. It burned badly. So, what we're doing here today is I took my stone off. I got a lot of great ideas. It's amazing uh, when something doesn't go quite right, and you, and you post that video how many people respond to it. I had a lot of responses. Uh, but what we're going to do here is uh, we're going to get that stone warm. I'm not going to get things hot. You can see I've got my black stone set on really close to low. And uh, I'm going to use a pan like a cover over a pizza to make it act like a, like a stove more or less, like an oven. So we're going to give this a shot. And uh, if she don't work today, well, then I'm done, and we'll go back to doing it on the Blackstone Pizza Oven, which you should say, well, why don't you do that anyway? And the reason is I've seen other people do it on the Blackstone Griddle, and I want to see if I can do it on the Blackstone Griddle. So keep on Oops, watching. There's our Blackstone. There's our pizza ready to go. Let's see what our, our stone is at. Uh, well, you can see right around 213, 215. Our steel here is ooh, in the 400s, uh, low 400s. It just went down a notch or so. Uh, so we're going to put this on, and we're going to cover it up. And uh, we'll see what happens. Keep on watching. All right, folks, there's 10 minutes. Uh, just some quick looks at our temps here. The griddle top itself is running right around, ooh, it's right around 500 there. Uh, my uh, tin on the side is right around 300 at the top. It's almost cool to the touch. My stone in the front here is 250 to 60. In the back, in the back, the stone is reading about 300. Let's take a quick look at our pizza here. You see, things are melting up, and uh, it doesn't look like well, the crust is not burning. Otherwise, it'd be smoking. So, so far, so good. I'm gonna let this go. I'm thinking maybe another 10 minutes, and we'll give you a look see uh, before she comes off. All right, folks, there's 20 minutes. Let's take a quick look. Oh, yeah, looking like pizza, eh? You can see our, our crust is browning up. And it is not black on the brown one. It's, it's brown. I mean, this is probably about ready to come off. I'm going to let it go just for a minute or two, and then we'll show you when she's all sliced up. Well, folks, there's the final product. Turned out pretty nice. I, is that the preferred way to cook a pizza? No, I got a black stone... Uh, See, there's the bottom. Can you? Uh, you can't really see the bottom here. Let me see if I can get you. To see, there's the bottom. It's it's brown, but it's it's crust. It's a little crispy, but it's it's good. Uh, it turned out this is not the preferable way. I I I doubt that I'll ever do it again on the Blackstone griddle because I got a Blackstone oven. Uh, but it can be done, and uh, for some reason I had to prove to myself that it could be done. So. Can be done. Uh, leave a comment, thumbs up, thumbs down. And, uh, don't forget to subscribe. Tom Horseman at YouTube. And as always, folks, thanks for playing along and uh, thanks for watching. I do appreciate it.